Today I'm going to show you how to make a really easy smoky paprika chicken tray bake using all of these ingredients and as always I've written a full blog post which I'll leave down below which will give you all the step-by-step -step instructions and the recipe that you can pin, bookmark, save for when you, you want to make this chicken tray bake and if you're new to my channel make sure you subscribe for more videos just like this and leave a like and a comment too. Let me know if you give this recipe a try, any adaptations you make. So let me talk you through all the ingredients we've got. I've chosen to go with chicken drumsticks over there but you can use any piece of chicken you want I've got a kilo which is about 2.2 pounds of chicken drumsticks we've got our paprika over there and now I've decided to go for all red vegetables we've got a red pepper some radishes red onion and these are kind of purpley garlic as well so those are the veggies I'm choosing but you can use any vegetables you like and I'm using extra virgin olive oil and salt to bring it all together. So I'm going to get on step number one and chop up all my veggies and pop it into my roasting dish. And I've got all of my veggies prepared. I've quartered the onion. I've just left the garlic whole because they kind of otherwise disintegrate to nothing and we, we just love our garlic. I have chopped the tops and bottoms off of the radishes and left them whole and I have very roughly chopped up the red pepper. So that's all the veggies prepared in my roasting dish and now I'm going to pop all of the chicken on top. Right, top the veggies with the chicken and now I'm going to pop over my extra virgin olive oil just a tablespoon at a time. I'll start with one tablespoon. Yep, definitely going to use a second tablespoon. Yep. And then a generous few shakes of salt all over. And then our paprika. I've got my paprika over here and really just do kind of a half a teaspoon or a little bit at a time all over everywhere until you're happy with the amount of paprika that is on your chicken. And then we'll shake it all about. And the oven is preheated to 180 degrees Celsius, which is 350 Fahrenheit. And it's going to go in for half an hour at a time. Start with half an hour and then turn it all over, give it a good shake, and then a further half an hour or until it is cooked to your liking. So yeah, that's completely smothered in paprika and now just go and just kind of smother it around, mix it all over. If you really want, you could marinate the chicken before, pop the chicken into a bag with the paprika and olive oil and your salt, pepper, whatever you like and give it a few hours to marinate in the fridge. But if you're like me and do everything last minute, then it's definitely doable. Just won't have as rich and deep a flavor. I'll just give it a good shake to get everything all over the place. Yep, yeah. okay, so now it's going to go into the oven for half an hour and we'll see how it looks then. It's been in the oven for half an hour and I'm going to flip everything over, give it a mix around and then pop it back in for another half an hour. The house is smelling pretty nice and smoky with a smoky paprika and yeah, looking forward to trying it in another half an hour's time. And there you go, it's out the oven. Look how golden and beautiful my chicken drumsticks are and all the vegetables beautifully cooked and it's just such a flavorful meal that you can adapt whatever vegetables you like to include and whatever piece of chicken you want. But as I said earlier, there is a link down below to the blog post which will have step-by-step -step instructions, all the photos and the recipe that you can pin, bookmark, save for whenever you want to make this easy paprika chicken bake. It's a mouthful. So thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe for more videos and leave a comment to let me know if you give this recipe a try. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again soon. Bye!